You need surgery. Three words no one wants to hear. I cried, I fussed. I was hysterical for at least two weeks before my appointment. Oh, it was, it was very, very stressful. But it doesn't have to be. Judy made a decision that had an outcome she never expected. If I knew it was going to be this easy, I would have had it from day one. I couldn't believe how much of a, not a piece of cake, but it was pretty easy recovery. What do Judy, Marianne, and tens of thousands of other women have in common? They had da Vinci surgery. This video will explain your surgical options for a hysterectomy, what da Vinci surgery is, and what's involved, and da Vinci's potential benefits to patients. So what are the main reasons women have a hysterectomy? Many have been diagnosed with cancer, but doctors often recommend a hysterectomy for benign or non-cancerous conditions, such as fibroid tumors, severe endometriosis, heavy bleeding, pelvic pain, and uterine or vaginal prolapse, or falling. If you've been told you need a hysterectomy, you may be able to choose between traditional open surgery, a vaginal approach, traditional laparoscopic surgery, or a minimally invasive da Vinci surgery. Traditional open surgery is commonly used for most gynecology procedures. Surgeons make a long incision to reach your uterus. Open surgery allows doctors to see and touch your organs as they operate. A vaginal approach with no external incisions is used for some gynecology procedures when visibility is adequate. Traditional laparoscopy is minimally invasive. Surgeons use long-handled, manually operated instruments and a miniature camera to operate through small incisions. The camera sends images back to the OR to guide doctors as they operate. Da Vinci surgery is also minimally invasive. Robotically assisted Da Vinci enables surgeons to perform both routine and complex cases through a few small incisions. The Da Vinci surgical system is 100% physician controlled. Da Vinci's camera gives your surgeon a remarkably clear 3D high definition view inside the body. Da Vinci instruments have tiny wrists that can bend and rotate far greater than the human wrist. Surgeons say it's as if their hands are miniaturized and working in your body. As a result of Da Vinci technology, Da Vinci hysterectomy offers the following potential benefits compared to open surgery. Less blood loss, fewer complications, a shorter hospital stay, and minimal scarring. And compared to traditional laparoscopy, Da Vinci hysterectomy offers the following potential benefits. Less blood loss, a lower conversion rate to open surgery, a shorter hospital stay, and less need for narcotic pain medicine. Potential risks of any hysterectomy, including da Vinci, are separation of the vaginal incision, blocked lung artery, urinary tract injury, and hernia. During a hysterectomy, doctors remove part or all of the uterus. They gently free the ovaries from connective tissues one at a time, then carefully remove the uterus, the cervix, both fallopian tubes, and both ovaries. The surgeon then stitches the internal opening closed, again, all done through small incisions on the lower abdomen. The residents graduate and have a big party in June, um, and I don't like to miss a party, and I went to the party when I was like, or six days post-op and they were like, what are you doing here? But I was even on a dance floor. I said I wouldn't have been like this, been able to come to the party and dance on the dance floor if I would have had major abdominal surgery. It, it was amazing to me that I didn't have any pain. I, I had the surgery Friday, came home Saturday. By Sunday I had company. I was up, dressed, showered. Um, I was feeling fine. It was amazing. I was totally amazed that I felt this great. You should discuss the specifics of your operation with your doctor. 
The extent of the surgery will depend on your individual condition. Ask your doctor about all treatment options for your condition. Ask about what you can expect before, during, and after surgery. Ask about Da Vinci surgery.